Hi, this is Gina DNS Maintenance Report as current as of Monday on the 20th here. Uh, perch fishing on Lake Mendota has been very good right this whole season and continues to be good right now. There's catching fish, some fish between Governor's Island and the Four Doors. There's a lot of guys fishing between Fox Bluff and uh, Commodore Bar and also out to a Second Point, that whole area there. The guys that are walleye fishing on the bars have been complaining a little bit, actually, that they've actually been getting perch while they're walleye fishing with jig and rapalas and on some fathead minnows under their tip-ups at times. And they're pretty nice-sized fish. There's a lot of fish that are between 9 and 11 inches. There's a few that are smaller. Once in a while you get one bigger, but 11 inches is a nice fish out here on the chain. Ice conditions on Lake Mendota are good. We're looking at 8 to 12 inches of ice in most areas now and very little snow cover at the moment. That could change if we get a little more snow here, but right now travel is good. I don't really hear of any cracks or a problem at the moment. As the ice starts to expand, we'll start to see more of those heaves and stuff uh, starting to occur around the lake. But right now there's really not much of that. Walleye fishermen are struggling a little bit out on the bars. I do occasionally hear a few showing up. And the pike guys are having a little bit of luck up in North Shore Bay and then over on the University shoreline. I've been hearing some bluegill action over in Squaw Bay. Uh, and a few perch in the weeds there, and they're still getting a few pike way in the back of the bay. As far as perch go out on Lake Monona, that continues to be a bit of a struggle from what I can hear. Every once in a while you get a good report, but usually it's a few fish and uh, and kind of a struggle. Lake Wabisa, uh, the perch fishing down there has been pretty slow, and the crappies. I have started to hear a little bit of bluegill action on the south end of the lake, but uh, not a whole lot. Mud Lake continues to probably produce most of the bluegills in the area and a few crappies in there. And I did forget to mention Monona Bay and the Triangle. Now, it's not drawing a crowd. It's not fast and furious. But I've been talking to a couple of guys that are just patient, and they've been fishing around in both the bay and the Triangle. And they said after several hours, they actually put together a nice little bag of fish and some pretty nice bluegills in a 7 to 8 inch range, mostly probably 7, 7 and a half. Lake Higanza has been pretty quiet. There is a fishery coming up on Lake Higanza this weekend, the Stoughton Conservation Club's fishery. Uh, so that's always fun, and they give away a lot of nice prizes down there. But that's about all that's going on here locally up on, um, what was it, Fox Lake. I'm still talking quite a few guys that have been over there catching a few crappies and a few walleyes and a little bit of pike action. Crystal Lake, they're catching some smaller bluegills and perch from what I hear, an occasional crappie. Uh, over on Fish Lake up there, they were catching quite a few pike recently. I didn't hear that in the last day or two, but recently I heard quite a few pike up there. I haven't really heard anything at all up on Lake Wisconsin at the moment. If you've got any questions or you got anything you'd like to share, you can call us here at the store at 608-241-4225. Thanks. Bye.